Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, it's me, Dr. Donna. Welcome to week 29 of nine. Last week I read, you got it, now go get it. Here's what I have for you. Ladies and gentlemen, this book is about people on a path of self-discovery. The author writes this book and puts it in four categories, self-mastery, leadership, how to launch your personal brand, and engaging an audience. What I would like to say is, yes, I am recommending this book. I'd also like to say that this book was well-written. It was well-published for a self-published book. There are illustrations, and it is simple. Like my book is broken down into sections, and while it's over 300 pages, it's still a quick read because the author has ADHD and dyslexia, and he wanted to be able to make it so everybody could read it. So there are illustrations. There are personal stories. It's an honest, and I mean an honest honest approach to self-mastery. It's a path for self-discovery. And I believe even if you're already on that path, and even he says in the book, if you have your life together, you don't necessarily need to read the book. But I'm saying you do need to read the book because there are great tidbits of information and just perspective. And he wants you to read the book and be able to think. He even says, if you don't agree with him, that's cool. If you believe you can do a better job of writing a book, that's cool too. But at least you're going to be thinking and talking about the things things in the book and that's what he wants and I believe that that is what he has done. It is a good book. I do recommend that you get the book and make sure that you continue to grow and go. The final thing that I'd like to say about the book is this is the first time that I've read a book where someone else had book challenges and they challenged themselves to read a book a week and I think this is great. He also said that he learned so much and because he started on this path of self-discovery, he was able to take all of that information from those books that he read, and he started a podcast as well as self-publishing a book. I told you there's power in reading every day. So yes, I absolutely 100% recommend the book. Last week's New Beginning, I looked up five-letter words that begin with X, a new word every day. And here's that list. This week's book, Becoming Trader Joe. Well, that's my time, ladies and gentlemen. But before I get out of here, just remember the power of nine. New beginnings expand your mind. Adios.